So, it is 6 p.m. on Friday, which means it is time for Road to the Knockout. We have got a pretty crazy team with Haaland, Bruno, Osman, Saka, Luis Diaz. We have a really good team here of players to pack. Hopefully, we can get one or two of them. I've got 24,000 feed points as well as some save packs. Let's just jump straight into it and try and get ourselves some Road to the Knockout. EA, I would love a Bruno Fernandez. I'm wearing my United shirt. On purpose for a Bruno. So if you can please give me one, that would be absolutely fantastic. Fingers crossed we can get one. These packs are all untradeable, so I'm discarding the untradeables because they are. I, I have so many untradeables. And we also have promo packs. We have, ooh, new store packs. Okay. All right, EA. We'll be opening those in a minute as well. Let's start off with my save packs, though. Small gold rare players pack. This is nothing, really, is it? Argentina. Oh, it's even a Conan Ball card. Okay, that is terrible. We'll go ahead and skip that. Or you discard the rest. All right. Now I think we've got a 50k and two 100k packs. EA, please. Just one row to the knockout, please. All right. 50k first. Spanish. CDM. Coke? I think. 84 Coke. Not a great start at all. Not a great start from EA. We get wear in there as well. Uh, I'll swap all of those. Sadly, that Darwin is a duplicate untradeable. I don't think anyone else there is worth absolutely anything at all. So we'll discard those. All right. Come on. Two 100k packs EA, please. First one. Here we go. It's not going to be a Rosa knockout, I don't think. It's a Spanish centre-back from Al Nasser. It's... I swear Laporte is one of the most common players in 100k packs. I'm not even kidding. He is in so many 100k packs. The amount of 100k packs I've opened and he has been the face card is honestly... Just laughable. We'll swap these over, though, and hopefully get some tradables that will build up a few coins at least. That is such a shame. I was really hoping from one of these we'd get something good. But we do have another one yet. So let's see if we get one from the next one. I just want to see Rota Knockout Portugal Cam. Here we go. No Rota Knockout, sadly. It's going to be English right back. Carl Walker? Who's that? It is a walkout. No double, sadly. It is bronze. All right, well, we do get an ace rated walkout. That's not too bad. At least it wasn't a Di Maria troll. Those weren't great, sadly. Let's go into the FIFA points. It looks like we've got a lot of content in the store now as well. We have got eight prime golds, 12 premium golds, a nano season opener, a premium season opener, and a foundation season opener. So first one contains 30 golds, one guaranteed 85 or higher. What are the percentages? So 4.1% of a UCL rose to the knockout, 1.2% of a UWCL, and then a 1.1% of a Europa League, and a 2.4% of a Conference League. All right, here we go. Let's open it. 2,000 FIFA points. It's not going to be a road to the anything. Trent. Go on, be a double walkout at least. Not a double walkout either. Yikes. All right, not a great start for 2,000 FIFA points. Not a great start at all. Okay, Trent Alexander-Arnold. What else we got in there? Got ourselves Inform Whitaker. Gabriel Jesus is not bad, to be fair. And Ludmilla. He's actually not a bad looking card either. Um, apart from that, nothing else really spectacular. I don't even think Trent's tradable, sadly. I think he's untradable, which is a bit of a shame. Oh, no, he is tradable. Okay, now we're good. We're good. He is tradable. All right, let's store the rest of those in this club. Let's get our base hero and base icon loan. QL is not a bad hero loan. And then we've got a base icon loan as well. It's going to be. Could be Skolze. All right, we'll take Skulls there. Not bad. Now the foundation season opener. 13 red golds, one guaranteed 84 or higher. A significant drop in the percentages as well. So, here we go. Let's see what we get. No special card. It's going to be German. CDM Kimmich. Oberdorf at least, hopefully. All right, it is Oberdorf. It's not a double walkout either. I know that's an untradeable duplicate as well, which is a big shame. Um, we get Blundell in there as well. Fabinho, Lukaku. It ain't looking good, bruv. It ain't looking good. We do have a bunch of loans, though. Let's see who we get in our loans. Loan, one or 286 plus. Bernardo Silva. Brilliant. Do not need a Bernardo Silva. We have a two base hero loan. Gomez or Campos. I'm taking Campos. And then we have a one of two base icon loan. It's going to be... Uh, Luis Figo, that's okay. And the last store pack is a 150 point store pack. I don't think anything will be from this. We'll open it just to see what we can get from it anyway. It's going to be USA, goalkeeper. I'm skipping it. I know that's like less than 84 rated, right? I think I think it's it's low rated. Yeah, 83 rated Murphy. Brilliant. All right, now it's time for eight prime gold player packs. I'm not going to sit here and make you watch every single one unless every single one's really good. And then we will. Uh, that can't be Harry Kane. Wow, is that Callum Wilson a prime gold players pack? 
That's not a great start of his. Oh, oh, okay. All right. We are, uh, that's the game we're playing. Okay. That is a shame. Like I said, I won't make you sit here and watch every single Prime Gold players pack. I'll only show you guys the good ones. But at the moment, I don't even think there'll be any good ones, to be honest. Is that at least Emmy Martin as 85? The pack look today is not, not a great start. Not a great start for the pack look today at all. I guess we'll take 85 Martinez, but not amazing. Barella? It might be Barella. I doubt it's for tasing a Prime Gold, surely. Yay! Okay, we'll take Barella. 86 walkout Barella. Not bad. I was going to say, I doubt it'd be 80 rated for TC in a Prime Gold. Is Barella worth a little bit? Might be worth about 20k. So I guess we'll take that. That is okay. Store the rest in the club. Discard the rest. That is not terrible, Barella. Um, at least it is a walkout. It's our first walkout from these Prime Golds as well. But there's only about eight of them as well. So I was kind of hoping we get better than what we've been getting. Center mid. Bernardo Silva? It could be Nunez, but I think it won't be. Yes. All right. Back to back walkouts. 88 Bernardo. That's not bad. He's probably worth a good like 10, 20k as well, maybe. 88 rated that. Is he? Okay. Yeah. Maybe like 30k. All right. So the last two Prime Golds there were actually pretty good. I'm quite happy with that. That is pretty decent. All right. Three remaining. Come on. I just want to see a different color of the like little lights pop up. I just want to see like blue or whatever color it is. And I want to see the animation. I think it'll look amazing. Please, EA. I just want to see the animation, man. Show us something good in one of these packs, please. Show me the animation. I beg. No, not in this one. It's going to be Serbia. Striker. From Juve. Vlahovic. Wow. These aren't very good, are they? Uruguay. Center mid. Valverde. Valverde, let's go, man. That's huge. Get in there, Valverde. That is a monster pool. Oh, my word. What are we saying for Valverde? Surely he's a lot, right? 300k. Oh, that is a massive W. Get in there. That's fantastic, man. Federico Valverde. I'll be honest with you. I'm selling him. I'm going to sell him. I'm saving up right now. I want to buy a big boy icon, so I'm saving up. That is huge. Get in there. That is a monster pool in the last prime gold. Nice. Now we've got 12 premium golds. Again, not going to sit here and make you watch all of them. Just the good ones. Um, and I'll see you guys when we get our next big pool. That isn't Busquets. Germany. Center mid. All right. We have another walkout. It is Gundogan. Be a double. Why not? No. Okay. We have Gundogan as another walkout. 86. I do have a little bit of hope sometimes in these packs. Because, like, the thing is with these packs... You get an 86, and there is a very, 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 very small chance you can get something like Rashford, Tamori, Varane, um, Walker. A lot of these cards are like 70, 80, 90, 100k still. So you've still got that little bit of hope and, and a little bit of prayer that you get like an 86 Gundogan, who's not that exciting. And boom, behind that, 80 to 100k player, that's 85 rated. However, it's not looking likely. Be Cobell. Okay, never mind. It's not even a goalkeeper. Two of these packs remaining, chat. We've not had a UCL or UEL or any road to the knockout. Is that Onana? We'll take Onana. Not bad. 85. Big Onana. I, I hope he's got his price range updated now. Okay, his price range is updated. He probably sells for about 5k. So I guess we'll take Onana. It's not too bad, to be fair. Obviously, we have got connections with Onana being a United keeper. I love him, man. I think he's great. And the last 25k pack of the promo packs in the store Barca oh Putellas I beg oh Padre Guardo oh, no. just be Putellas she just came out of packs she literally just came out of packs as a green card which means she's a gold again I thought it might have been oh my word I don't know what her, her player style plus is, though. That's still a 35k player, though. We'll take that. And Orzio's in the pack as well. So we'll happily take that. We'll happily take that. Okay. I feel like those promos were actually pretty good to us. All right. UAS has got the two store packs now to open. Let's see if we get something good. All right. First one now. It's not going to be a road to the knockout. It's not going to be Haaland. It's going to be Erdegaard. Maybe a double walkout. 87s aren't that high. This is potential. No double, sadly. Realistically, you want right wing as well. Right wing, if it's if it's a gold Norwegian walkout. That's not bad, though. Gabriel Jesus and Ramsdale. Big Arsenal presence in that pack. And Kim Min Jae. If Kim Min Jae's tradable, go on, be tradable. He's not tradable. Never mind. I was going to say that'd be fantastic because he's worth about 20k, but he's not, sadly. And then we have the loans. He's got uh, Prince, I guess. No, a new hero. A new icon, sorry. Let me take that. And now for the premium season opener. I'm seeing a lot of people pack gold versions of the road to the knockout players. I don't know if 
that's deliberate from EA. Someone apparently said that they're putting both versions of players in packs. I really hope that's not the case. And if, if that isn't the case, I guess you'll get compensation. And maybe I've packed one and I haven't noticed it then. I hope I have. That'd be great. Um, Kimmich there, daily. Not the not the most amazing pack right there. Sure, many in the dupes. Not not great, sadly. All right, we've just had cl actual clarification right now. The reason why people are passing, packing base Mertens and base Lima is because they're actually not in packs yet. They are likely in the mini release, and that's why they're not in packs yet because they weren't on the actual um, graphic that EA tweeted. So it's likely going to be a mini release. Is that that's an 84 double with an 84 of the base card? That's just disgusting. I hate that so much. That is gross. You've got to hope Tamori is in, in this pack then. I think he's the most expensive 84, right? It's Of course, it's an English centre-back from the Serie A, and it's not Tamori. It's Smalling. That's awful. So we've got 12,000 FIFA points remaining of the 24K. I'm going to rip through 7.5K premium gold packs to see if we can get anything good in the remaining 12,000 FIFA points from the 24K FIFA point pack opening. Hopefully we can. If not, it is what it is, but hopefully we can. And I'll see you guys if we get anything good. Oh, is that Trent? Hey, walkout alert. We have ourselves Trent Alexander-Arnold. That's probably like 10, 15K right there, I reckon. I really hope he gets a usable special card this year. It's less than 10K. That's crazy. I hope he gets a good usable special card this year. Because that playstyle plus with the crossing is insane. If you have anybody that can head a ball in the box and you have the playstyle plus with crossing, genuinely nuts. So hopefully he gets a really good a really good upgrade with pace and he'll be one of the best right backs in the entire game. And I and then I will literally go and buy someone that's amazing at heading the ball just so that I can have Trent whipping the ball in and whoever it is up top heading it in rather than flipping left back. Oh, we got one. She didn't even show up. What? Rosia showed up before her. Are you joking? Why did why don't I get to see the animation, man? The guy says hooth. Oh my word. I'm not going to lie to you, right? I'll say this right now. I think this card could be insane if she gets the upgrades. She's got potential for three upgrades rather than two, right? But looking at this card, it's got very, very good play styles. Incredible agility and balance. She's five foot four. I bet she's really hard to get the ball off. Um, and the potential with the upgrades to be a very nice card at cam or right wing. So yeah, that's a solid card. I, we got one. We packed ourselves a road to the knockout. Sadly, Rosier popped up first. That's so strange. Oh! Hey, we got one. We got ourselves Ed in Jekko. Let's see the animation. Oh, that looks amazing. That animation's so cool, man. That animation's so cool. We got ourselves Ed in Jekko. Bonabache looked very good this year, so almost guaranteed to get the upgrades. I don't think he'd be that good, but I'm still going to try. I might try him out at some point. I feel like big six foot four Jekko. Um, he didn't even have the power header trait. Damn, I thought he might. Um, 83 jumping, 89 head accuracy. Probably be pretty good if you just cross the ball to him. Hey, we'll take that. And cool the ball in the same pack. Solid. That animation's so cool. So we packed two so far, actually. The 7.5k packs have been luckier than the promo packs. Italia. Left mid. From Juventus. I can't be Chiesa, can I? It can be Chiesa. All right, we'll take that. Is he still a little bit expensive? I feel like he's still worth a little bit, right? Woohoo! 50k? Yes, please. Get in there. I thought Chiesa was a left wing. Left mid will take it. That is class. All right. We have two 7.5k packs remaining, and then that's 24,000 fever points gone through. And I, I can't lie. I think we've done really well with this 12k. I think that we have actually packed some really good stuff. We've had... For example, Valverde, but a lot of like 20 to 50k players as well. The likes of the likes of those like the aces and people like that, they really do add up. But I think we've actually done really, really well. We're ending off with a Croatian center forward. It's going to be none other than I forget this guy's name actually. I don't know who it is. Is uh, Velasic? There you go. All right. Well, 24k well spent actually. All right. Otto's doing a store pack. Here we go. We want to see a nice pulled line. Okay, so gold card. Right wing. No, don't be a third of guard. Be a double walkout, please. No, it's not a double either. Mm, not ideal. Fair enough. All right, Erdegaard is at least an 87. Decent foddy. Got an 85 and Henry in there as well. 
Um, any decent dupes? A Rashi or something that you've got tradable, maybe? No. No, that's a shame, isn't it? All right, now for the 1,000 FIFA point pack. Let's see if it's better. Right wing? Striker? Cam? Chelsea? Oh, no, that's like 84, isn't it? Oh, my word, that's bad. All right. Samori? No. I don't know what we're hoping for at this point. Gavi and Mancini. Brilliant. 